four easy ways to make sure you maximize the pee shot. Hi everybody, my name is Dr. John Lucio. I practice integrative medicine and pain management in Jefferson City, Missouri. Welcome to our channel, J&J House Call. This is my wife. Hi, I'm Dr. Jennifer Sue. I practice conventional gynecology, sexual health for both men and women, and integrative medicine. Welcome back to our channel. If you have not ever joined us, we're so happy you're here, and consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you know when we've uploaded our next video. We are both integrative medicine doctors and keeping you well. So today's topic is about the pee shot. Originally, I was just gonna talk about what it is, but you can look that up on Cellular Medicine Association's websites. They talk about what the pee shot actually is. We are actually gonna be just tweaking it a little bit. We're talking about the four things you can do to make sure your pee shot is the most optimal outcome for you. So first we'll get into what actually is PRP, which is what we use for the P-Shot, and then we'll go into the four ways that simple things you can do to just maximize your results for the P-Shot that will help make your penis both increase in width, increase in length, as well as help with erection and can even help with Peyronie's disease. So let's start with uh, telling you what PRP is, and you may have heard about it uh, in the internet. It's platelet-rich plasma, which basically they, we take uh, the patient's own blood, we spin it down and concentrate the platelets, and they become activated, and then we inject them back into the body again, and they can do amazing things, and P-Shot's one of those things that uh, Dr. Sue uses, um, but she also does the what is called the O-Shot as well, and that's for women. So the first thing you wanna do is you, number one, wanna make sure that you're going to a qualified provider. These are ones that belong to the Cellular Medicine Association. If you type that in, it's a CMA. This is the association that qualified providers for the P-Shot have trained under Dr. Runnels or his associates, so it is the correct way to do things. They're not hiking up the price. The price should be worldwide the standard price if they belong to the Cellular Medicine Association, which protects you the price because it's trademarked. The second thing is because it is involving you getting your blood drawn during the procedure, it's a small portion of your blood, please make sure you optimize your ability to, for people to draw your blood. So drink a lot of fluids beforehand. This is not alcohol, this is water. Like get hydrated so your veins are really plump so they can draw your blood easier. Even lift a few hand rates if you can. If it's cold, wear a jacket. Keep yourself warm so that the veins pop so they're easy. it's easier to get your blood drawn. It's less blood sticks if they have trouble. Number three. You want to not smoke. Smoking negates everything with platelet-rich plasma. It just will not work. Smoking just kills any good effect from platelet-rich plasma. And the fourth thing is to use the pump. Use the pump. You want to use a pump after. We recommend the Dr. Kaplan penile or male enhancement pump. We sell it at our practice. You can look on this video. I'm going to link the video right there about the proper ways to use a penile or male enhancement pump. The idea is after you get your platelet-rich plasma treatment for your penis, you do want to maximize the ability for your body to heal and to grow new blood vessels, to grow new nerves into those areas. So you really need to use a good male enhancement pump. So afterwards, you're really going to, even that day when you get home, get blood flow into that penis and allow the platelet-rich plasma to really work to grow new blood vessels, to grow new nerves, which takes approximately three to four months before you see any results. And when you use the pump, don't over-pump. Over-pumping means that you're going beyond the amount of time that you were told to do or the amount of pressure that you're supposed to apply. Because when you do that, you're just stretching your penile skin out. You're not actually increasing the size of the, the core of the penis. You need to actually have both grow at the same time. That's it. So we hope that this is helpful. If you are interested in talking to me about getting a pee shot, I would love to meet you virtually, and I hope you contact me. The information is down below in the description. So next week, we're going to be talking about a mind-body technique called gratitude, and it's perfect because of the season of Thanksgiving. And I hope that you join us next week. So long, everybody.